Hey guys, so today I'm gonna be doing an unboxing of the Body Max Trainer. I'm super anxious and super excited to share with you guys this product. This is the first fitness belt that I've ever reviewed on my channel, so I'm excited. Thank you guys so much for sending this to me so I could try it and share it with everyone on YouTube or everyone in my community. Uh, this is a great opportunity, so I'm really appreciative. So this is actually the second time I'm doing this video. The first time I did it, it came out really blurry and I refuse to show you guys horrible content. So I just am doing the whole thing over again. So the first part of my video is gonna be me explaining the product and showing you the product. And the second part of the video is gonna be the first time I had my initial reaction and I actually used it and I'm when I'm actually coming back from the gym. So let me go ahead and share with you the product. Um, if you love this video, don't forget to go ahead and hit the subscribe button and also hit the notification bell so that way you can see all my unboxings or my clothing hauls. I'm a plus size girl and I want you guys to be confident in anything that you wear and I like to, you know, help out a little bit in that confidence area. And also I will be putting uh, the link to Body Max in my description box and I also do have a coupon code. Uh, the coupon code is XO Leslie and if you forget it will also be in my description box. Okay, so let's get into it. <laughs> and again, I am sorry that this is not my original, you know, unboxing, but like I said, I want you guys to see the product clearly and I want to make sure that you guys make an educated purchase if this is something you're looking for. So it came in this box. See, it says, here it is, Body Max, right? All right, so open her up. Bam, bam. It comes in this bag and of course it was closed when I got it. Uh, so I'm actually a size 16. Um, I am a size 18. If I'm bloated in the upper area, and my chest area sometimes gets a little bigger. And then sometimes it could be a large. It really depends on the store and the stretch or whatever I'm wearing. But for the most part, I am a size 16, 1X in majority of stores. This, however, I received in a 5XL. So please make sure you actually look at their video on how to measure yourself. It's very important that you get the correct size because if you go on their website and get an XL, I'm gonna assume it's not gonna fit. Because mine is literally a 5XL and I even emailed them in advance like, is that normal? And she was like, yeah, that's normal. So just keep that in mind. The really cool um, about this trainer is that there's three <laughs> layers of protection here or uh, what's that word? There's three layers of, I don't even know how to describe it. There's three ways to cinch yourself in, right? So the first way, you just get it all open for you. The first way is with the clips, okay? So you clip the little like bra strap clips like a, a traditional waist trainer. And after you clip yourself in, there is a zipper. So you clip and then you zip. And then after that, you Velcro, sorry, it's all put together, but you Velcro it around. So uh, I am going to put it on for you so you guys can see. I also wanna let you know that the inside is more of like a cotton material. Uh, it's not one of those like rubber materials, so I, would suggest wearing a t-shirt or a clothing underneath it because it's not built for sweat from what I'm seeing because it doesn't look like, I mean, although their website does say that you could just take a warm cloth and wipe it off if you want, I just feel like with the material, I don't want it to get dirty too fast. So I would suggest wearing it either really high leggings, right, underneath. Uh, so that way only like the top gets a little bit sweaty or you could wear, uh, a t-shirt or a tank top underneath completely up to you I usually go to the gym like this if that helps so let me put this bad boy on so you can see how easy it is to actually put it on cuz I already put it on clearly <laughs> all right the mirror so the mirror is right here so that's why I'm looking over here okay so first I want to make sure that the tag is on the top it is and then I'm going to go ahead and clip it from the bottom up so here we go all right so as you can see I have it cinched here um, so now I'm going to zip it I'm gonna zip it over here on the side 
All right, I now have it zipped clearly. And then I'm gonna take the Velcro. Just bam. And this is what it looks like, All right? So I wanna just make sure it's even here. Initially, it feels really comfortable. It's very soft on the skin. I don't feel any pinching. The one thing that I did notice the first time I put it on is that it makes a lot of noise like when you make, like when you bend over. <laughs> but I'm not hearing it anymore, so maybe because I wore it out and I worked out on it already. Um, so this is the back. And you're gonna see my initial reaction to this, obviously, because I clearly tell you like if it moves around in the second half of the video, okay? So initially, it's really comfortable, it's really soft, and it's not as tight as like, uh, a waist trainer would be because that's not like this is a workout trainer so you need to be able to breathe I feel like because originally I had it on way too tight and then I realized I had it on way too tight and I had to loosen it while I was at the gym because it was too much but I'll explain all of that in the second half of the video so I will be right back all right guys so I just got back from the gym I know I don't look like I just got back from the gym but I laid my hair back down because it was looking crazy <laughs> and I didn't want to look crazy guys so I am back, so I have a couple of things to say about it. Here it is again, I have not taken it off. So before I do take it off, I wanted to tell you a couple of things. I do this to myself all the time. I always say, okay, the one thing I wish I would have done is gotten a full back waist trainer. I say it every video because I have back fat and this is the most uncomfortable part of waist trainers for me because I do have such a significant amount of back fat and it, it's really, really aggravating. Um, and it, as you can see, it fell down. And I'm not even doing anything now, so this must have happened after. But I would strongly suggest if you have even a little bit of back fat, remotely a little bit of back fat, back fat in general, just get a full back trainer. They have them. I think I would have enjoyed the experience a lot more if I had a full back waist trainer. But... Another thing I noticed is that I don't think this is meant to help you sweat, so don't get them confused because this is legit just a waist trainer for the gym because the cotton doesn't really help you sweat and I don't feel like it's very thermal. I didn't feel too hot, so if you don't like feeling hot, great. But I, I also don't have the cream on their website. They have like this cream that you could put on to help you sweat, but I don't have that, so maybe that would help with that process. But... What I will say is that my back did not hurt, not once. My back be hurting and I could bend down, but it makes a lot of noise, it's kind of embarrassing. It'd be like <sighs> But the music was so loud in the class that nobody noticed, of course, or nobody really cares. Let's be honest, when you go to the gym and you're insecure, nobody really cares. So, um, this is the first time I'm taking it off. Let's see. Um, I will say I was really comfortable. Oh, look, this was already undone. <laughs> um, that's how you know I worked out hard. Let's see. I want to see if I'm like really, oh yeah, I'm really sweaty. Oh my God, this is disgusting. This is like soaking wet. So maybe it does help with sweating without the cream. So that's good. Let's see. Oh, oh. yeah, this, this thing is soaked. <laughs> Even though you can't see it, you really can't. I wish you could see it. You can't see it because it's, it's cotton. So it's sucking up all the liquid, but my leggings ew they're literally so, oh my god every go like this and i do that it feels so cold because it's soaked so this whole part of my body is soaked gross okay but i will say that i immediately feel really good that's the thing about waist trainers the reason why i love waist trainers is because it immediately gives me confidence whether or not it's doing anything it doesn't matter to me in the beginning because I know that I'm on my way to being serious about my health. That's why I really love it. And also because I have big breasts, you really should work out with something. This this is another reason why I really strongly suggest waist trainers because you have to work on your posture when you have big a bigger chest like me. So, yeah. I really like it. Like I said, girl, if you have back fat, get you a full back one because that could annoy you. But if you don't care that it like rolls down a little bit because my other waist trainers roll down all the time too, um, other unless it's a full back one, then don't worry about it. Go for this one. Uh, another thing that might be helpful with the rolling down is if you get a regular sports bra. This is not a regular sports bra. Uh, this has like 
wristbands and zips and blah blahs. So if you just get a regular sports bra in your size, um, just random basic, you can get them from Walmart. That will help with the waist trainer. Uh, but that would be better to wear for like lifting. See, I was taking a class where there's a lot of jumping, dancing, movement. So uh, of course it's going to adjust. I wasn't expecting it just to stay in place the whole time. It would have been impossible. But for the amount of movement it did, it did a really good job with staying in place. Um, I also had to loosen the Velcro part around because I was like, who do I think I am? I thought I was going to die. I thought that I could. So, you know, work your way in, you know, even though I use waist trainers a lot, I still was like, okay, you're doing too much, Leslie. Calm down. All right. <laughs> but I really do enjoy how it felt. Um, and I would suggest getting one because the, it's the mentality as well. You know, it does work really well and it did helped me sweat a lot in my midsection and it gave me a really good posture. I will say that my mentality is better when I'm wearing a waist trainer. This is disgusting though. Oh, I cannot wait to take a shower because I swear to you, this whole thing is soaking wet. I should have probably put it a little bit lower, but even down here is so wet. Oh, I don't like that. I mean, it's a good thing, but I don't like it. So, I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like I said, this is called the Body Max Trainer, and I will put it in my description box where you can get your own, and don't forget to use my coupon code uh, to get your own. If you have big breasts, I'm telling you, you wanna start wearing something to support your back because you're already doing so much. And I also would suggest wearing this for when you're lifting and doing a lot of like, uh, I do a lot of deadlifts and squats. This would be perfect for it. Um, even though I did take more of like a dancey class today, um, and, and that was difficult because, girl, I was sucked in trying to dance. I was all stiff, but you know what? I feel immediately really good. So, yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching this video, and I'll see you next time.